Hello, friends, and welcome back to Bulldog Books. I am Miss Sunshine, and we are going to start our reading off today with some nonsense word practice. You guys know how this works. You'll have one minute to read as many of these nonsense words as you can, and then you pause the video to keep track of how many you read. On your mark, get set, go. And stop right there. Now pause the video, go back, count the number of nonsense words you were able to read in one minute, and then keep track of your score to make sure that each time you're getting a little better at reading those nonsense words. Yay, I am so excited about this book, you guys. I don't even know. Check it out! So there is a series called Super Cute. The title of this book is Super Cute Baby ducks. Now, of course, I had to choose this book because I have seen some baby ducks as I have been out exploring by the river and near some ponds. And I hope you get a chance to do the same thing and that you see some little ducklings. Ducklings, as we read on page four, is what we call baby ducks. Are you ready to read this page to me? Begin. And now this page. And readers, have you noticed some text features on page six? Bold text is a text feature that lets us know that the author wants us to pay attention to some vocabulary words that they have included. So let's read the two bold text words. One word is the word hatch, and that means to pop out of an egg. That's what this photograph of this cute baby duck is showing us. And then the other word is brood, and brood would be the group of eggs. So all of the eggs are laid at about the same time by a mother duck, and that's the brood. Let's take a look at page eight. Begin. What was the word the author wanted us to notice on page eight? That's right, the word waddle. And that's kind of the back and forth walking motion of a baby duck when it's going behind its mom. Read page 10, please. And now page 12. Oh, so we have two vocabulary words. We have webbed feet and we have the text feature of a label on page 13 to show us what a duck's or a baby duck's webbed feet look like. Now that back and forth motion of their webbed feet kicking in the water, that's what it means to paddle. Read page 14. Oh, in case you didn't know what their bill was, 
We have the text feature of a label pointing to exactly what the author is talking about. Bill is another way to refer to a duck's beak. Take a look at page 16. Ready? Read. <laughs> They're so cute. Read page 18. And now page 20. Oh, let's take a look at our glossary because we saw all of those bold words throughout this book about baby ducks. Do you remember seeing all of these different words? If you want to pause the video and review any of those words that we learned while reading about baby ducks, go ahead and pause. Now, before we go today, I want to ask you, do you think this baby duck book is fiction or nonfiction? If you said nonfiction, you're correct. This book provided us with true facts about baby ducks. So it is considered a nonfiction book because it is true or real. I hope you had fun looking at these cute baby ducks with me. I'll see you next time.